Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol BIMI. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. Real quick, what do I mean by 30 minute? In case you're new to charts, I do offer an explanation video at that link. So if you go there, I'll explain in detail. I don't mean to state the obvious, but I will, anyways. Very nice bounce today when you consider where the price was at its opening lows of the day, and then you look at where the price ultimately closed. Very, very impressive move. Any rational person, I, I, I would think, would say, yeah, that was definitely a, an impressive movement. But that does lead to the valid question now, of, but is there any sort of true power behind this price movement? Is there any sort of genuine strength? Or is this just some sort of knee-jerk reaction, dead cat bounce type move? I have no idea, but like I said, by using charts, we can make answering that question very straightforward. And in my mind, it all revolves around a single area, and that area is down here at $4, whoops, $4.50. Why is 4.50 important? Well, hopefully we can agree on the logic uh, that price movements with true power, with genuine strength, the price is gonna progress forward. The price is going to you know, make progress. It's not gonna go back to where it was. So with that in mind, think about $4.50. If the price were to go down to 4.50 and then just continue on down, what would that be doing to the price? Well, from a very you know, literal perspective, that would literally be putting the price right back inside of that range of the chart that it just broke out of. And as we just established, going back, not exactly a sign of true power, whereas if the price came down here, behaved like that, and then began to work its way back upwards, now all of a sudden, what would you have? Well, you'd have a set of lows right there. You'd have this set of lows down there. If you envision each one of those as stair steps, well, hey, now you have stair steps progressing in the upwards direction. And again, that's the name of the game. That's what a truly strong move is gonna do over time. It's gonna make progress forward. And again, in this situation, quote unquote progress, I'm defining as 450. As far as levels of resistance are concerned, it's all about that purple line there, the famous 50 period at simple moving average, and you can see it's already done its thing. Rejected the price there, and rejected it once again right there. Don't get me wrong, I'm not saying the price can never get up above that purple line. I'm just saying that from a you know, just a historical speaking perspective, meaning if you just even have a basic understanding of charts, I'm sure you've heard of the 50 period, and you know that when the price is down below it, it does tend to act as resistance. So not shocking to see the price acting as resistance there. So the price really is gonna have to bring it to A game if it's gonna be able to not only fight above that level, but stay up above it. All in all though, anyway, look at it. Great bounce today. Now it's just the question of can the price build upon this momentum going forward? Let's see what happens. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.